Since February 1978, the Greenpeace organization has been planning their anti-whaling strategy. They've purchased this aging rusty trawler with a grant from the Netherlands branch of the World Wildlife Fund. And for the next three months, Greenpeace volunteers will be working flat out to get it in fighting trim. When the tower bridge opened up very slowly and we sailed underneath and we knew that the journey had begun, we all stood right up forward with some bad champagne and toasted ourselves and the fact that this boat actually worked and that we were actually beginning this journey. None of us were being paid any money to do what we were going to do. In fact, it was at a personal cost to a lot of us. And sometimes along the journey of the Rainbow Warrior, various crew members would get off and work in factories in order to be able to pay to buy food for the crew on the Rainbow Warrior. So we were almost like paying to be part of the crew.